Hi, this is Kevin. I am creating a Jensen Button cartoon. Uh, I did this on commission for a friend. Uh, you'd see that I am starting to lay in very basic colors. Uh, there's a pencil sketch that you can't really see, but I wish you could. Uh, but it's very light, lightly laid out on Bristol board using a 5H pencil. Uh, I'm using a cheap highlighter to get the blue of Jensen's helmet, or the beginning of the blue. You'll see it grow as we, as we go. Uh, but I'm using a highlighter to get the blues and the reds so that they have a nice, strong, bright base. On these type of pieces, it's uh, important to me to keep the white. Uh, to keep, you, it's, you can always go darker, but you can never go brighter on these uh, with a natural look. Um, here you can see that I'm starting to actually lay in the grays of his suit, the shadows. Uh, this is what I look like when I when I create. I guess I'm very unamused. Um, I I wanted to capture the feel that he had when he won in Hungary. I think it was in 2000. I want to say seven or eight. Uh, he is so calm most of the days, but when he wins, he's actually he, he looks so excited and so happy. So uh, you can see that the, the the double pointing finger is a a uh, a pretty cool look for me. Uh, important part of, of these paintings for me is keeping the white, like I said earlier, and the visors are the coolest place to show that. Uh, the visors, I usually tend to pick a color that is not natural to the rest of the suit or uh, driver apparel. Uh, the visors can show so much personality and give you a nice pop if you pick a different one. So here, it's green when everything else is blue and red. Uh, I use a technique that I learned from watercolor and from painting because I have such a deep background in it of a wet into wet of taking one color, laying it down and coming back in with a secondary color so you get a nice blend of the two rather than being one color just sitting on top of the other. So trying to move in step by step so it's never a harsh transition unless that's what I'm actually going for. Uh, here you can see that I definitely picked a light source and I'm trying to um, stick to it. Uh, I like that the, everything on the bottom has a weight to it. I'm trying to show this perspective is a little off, but showing uh, all the depth of the fabric and uh, the size of the helmet and showing the shadows all over. Um, I think that's what gives the, the piece some, some dimension. Here I'm going back in and covering up the highlighter marks that I showed you before uh, into his helmet and making sure that everything has a weight, a balance, and a feel to it. And hopefully I did a good job of it, but it's uh, always a, a work in progress. And this one I'm actually pretty happy with.